Hello all, just another quick repair video. Got a uh, Sherwood RX4109. The problem was no power, no activity, and turned out that the uh, mains transformer was bad. And, and unable to find it, part number on the transformer, I even googled it. There's some people on some forums looking for this. It's uh, 820085869019S. And you can actually go online, you can actually find the factory that makes it. But uh, all attempts to contact them to get a replacement, there was nothing. So I was about ready to throw this away, but uh, started digging in this transformer. And we have a small thermal fuse, again, uh, between the primary and the secondary. It's just a little ceramic pellet down in there. And I was very carefully, I was able to dig it out. And I actually, using a pair of needle nose pliers, needle nose pliers, I could crush it the ceramic housing and I was able to pull the two leads up enough that I could solder this jump wire too so I was able to reestablish power to the primary and you don't need to it's just so the thing can't catch on fire I guess but I don't know I have transformers and equipment that's older than I am and they've never caught on fire and the circuit board has a fuse to protect you know the primary winding of the transformer so it's just a thermal fuse but I think it's an underrated thermal fuse not temperature wise but current wise so, you know, if you get a sudden spike on the power line, it, it's enough that it blows the current limiting factor of the thermal fuse. So, anyways, I've just removed it. I don't think it needs it. All this stuff's been working for years without thermal fuses in the transformer. So, just, it's just a weak link. So, transformer worked great. Receiver, it's working again. And power this guy back up here. There it goes.